I've always dreamed about owning my own business, and every business starts with an idea. And so, why am I in this school? It's actually where my business idea was born, and where I spent the last four years as a college swimmer. Now, I'm a swimmer, but I've continued my athletic career with some martial arts. Because I'm an athlete, I wanted to think of business ideas where I could sell to other athletes. To sell to athletes, I needed to find a problem that athletes have. After what felt like forever, I finally found a problem with the water. Not that water, this water. When it comes to athletic water bottles, you have two options. A squeezable bottle or a stainless steel bottle. Most athletes go for the squeezable bottle because of how quickly you can take a sip of water. But some others go for the stainless steel option because it keeps your drinks ice cold. So what path should I try to go down? Should I try to improve the stainless steel bottle or the squeezable bottle? I decided to make the best squeezable bottle on the planet. If I made it out of carbon fiber, the same material that they used to make race cars and rocket ships, I could keep the ability to drink quickly while taking the stainless steel's bottle ability to keep your drink cold all day. I have absolutely no idea how to work with carbon fiber, so I call the prototyping company to have it made for me. Yes, hello? Yes, I'd like to get one carbon fiber water bottle made, please. Oh yeah, I can totally do that for you. It will be $20,000. What the f Yeah, there is absolutely no way I was paying for that. So I bought some carbon fiber and a 3D printer, and I got to work. Keep in mind, I have absolutely zero experience designing or manufacturing things. But that didn't stop me, because I believed in myself. And that didn't stop me from absolutely failing miserably. I failed because I didn't understand a key fact on why stainless steel bottles keep your drink cold. It's called vacuum insulation. Vacuum insulation means that there's a vacuum layer of nothingness, like space, in between the drink and the outside world. This means that the heat has nothing to latch onto, keeping your drink cold for hours. So, a dejected Zwigs put that idea on the back burner for a few months. But I couldn't get the water bottle problem out of my head. And that's when I remembered the other path. I could make a better stainless steel bottle for athletes. I had to. And I needed to make a cap that could be opened just as fast as a squeezable bottle could be opened. There's no shortages of caps out there for stainless steel bottles. Three of the more common ones are the screws, the twists, and the pops. The pops are pretty good, except they look a little weird when they're open, and be a little flimsy, and they can't be opened with boxing gloves on. One of my newfound hobbies. So I got obsessed over water bottle caps for months, analyzing every little detail, all the pros and the cons. And eventually, I had a pretty good idea. I got back to work with the 3D printer. I was just mashing shapes together of what came into my brain. And that was a little harder than I thought. But after six months and countless fails, I finally had my idea. It's a water bottle cap. It opens fast, closes easily, looks sleek, new, and different, and it can be opened with boxing gloves on. And that's my idea. <laughs>